next step, next technique is lifting the front wheel, the wheelies. Just for showing off, obviously it's important to lift the front wheel for the logs and the rocks and any obstacles. Key is to want to use suspension and body and not relying on the gas. Just gas and not lift. The starting position is up tall on the bike. あの、最初、えっと、最初の段階として this movement is really important, pressure down, and then we want to use catch the rebound to go up. First we've got to pressure down. あの、最初にプレッシャーをかける。プレッシャーをかけるこの今のフォームで今の動きで、えっと、プレッシャーをかけるっていうのが重要です。で、そこで刺すのリバウンドを使って持ち上げる。So we're not moving at the hips, not the the shoulders going forwards. It's the arms and the legs moving head and shoulders quite still. So, to demonstrate, we're going to bounce the front wheel with the engine off. So, we want to get in the mindset of using suspension and not the gas. So, the first, just to get in the mind of suspension, we're going to bounce the front wheel. So, front and rear brake solid, just locked on. So you don't the wheels moving, suspension won't work. So you can see just doing this, the, the forks. So just to, if you're not confident, somebody can hold a bike. I'm, I'll come around and hold the bike if you're struggling, but just get the suspension moving good to start with. So we're always trying to all the techniques, I'm trying to get good progression for everybody and then the next step. It's a difficult exercise but it's really important to get in the mindset of using suspension. So I'm going to jump up and then flex down, bounce in the front. Brakes are on, just the arms and legs working. Sliding back a bit. The brakes on solid. And then keep going until the lungs start working as well. Yeah, so if you want to move to the left or the right, get your body in a little bit. Move the body first. Any, any pulling round with the bike, you need to be on the inside. You start pulling round. Otherwise, you can't move the bike like this. How much do you use a, a muscle during the uh, rebound? Yeah, it's all, you know, the main thing is the leg, you start to feel it in the leg, pressure with the legs, so the muscles, big muscles in the legs. We want to use them muscles to pressure down and pulling up. But it's all physical, so in reality afterwards it's easier, but this is difficult, it's all using the body, but if we go straight in to do the wheelies, it's difficult to get explain exactly the movement of the body. Everybody's thinking of the gas not. First push down. <laughs> Common mistakes pushing down like this, but you've got to get the harder for the old guys like me for the knees, the knees working. <laughs>
on straight, lean back a little bit, brake on, rear brake on. That's it. Forward, forward, <laughs> forward with the knee, forward with the knee. Ah. Pressure down a bit more, and then a big pull up. Just go for one hop. Don't worry about bouncing to start with, just get one good one to start. たくさんやるんじゃなくてこう一発こうホップするいけホップすることまずやってみましょうっていうことですねさあ、マックスダウンビッグフォローオッケーはいオッケーオッケーオッケーオッケーオッケーオッケーオッケーオッケーオッケー
brake, rear brake, legs, and then it, when it's compressed, I've got tension on the clutch to move forward. まあ、あのそれを最後にやったときにクラッチを、まあ、あのにテンションをかけて前に進んでいく。まあ、あの先ほどのステップを一つ一つあの積んでいくことで、あの一個一個の,そのステップに自信を持ってやれるようになることが大事だと。常に足を使おうと、なんかあの今、先ほど回ってる感じでも、上体を使ってしまってるっていうことがと間違いだよっていうことを指摘されるパターンが多かったので、足を使って。When it's slippery, we change the technique as well. Here is the grip. When it's slippery, we use suspension and not so much with a clutch. We've got to feel to get the grip and pressure in. More to 滑るようなところだとあのまあブレーキを使うというよりもあのクラッチの操作であの非常にやっていくことになると思います。First time I do it without the brake, and then just with rear brake. And then just, and then both Without brake and a rear brake? Yeah, I'll demonstrate yeah. one time to see the difference. Without the brake, just the rear brake, and then front and rear brake. <laughs>